So, the reason why I bought this new lock was for my daughter. She's now in grade 5 and she needs a lock. So I thought this would be a perfect lock, therefore I can do my product review on it. Let's start our product review. Hi, today we're going to do a review on this new master lock, 1534D. And can you really hack this lock? Well, we'll talk about that in just a few minutes. So first, let's set the lock. So this lock is preset to open at word 3. Now let's open it and change your combination. As you notice, as I take out the end cap and I start taking out the number, you'll start to notice there is a red marking there. Notice the red marking? Make sure these markings are lined up. We have an extra three combinations here that we could use. If you also notice, there is a slight indentation right here or a tongue and groove. This tongue and groove gives it a nice fit for the next combination to fit snugly together. Okay, let's change our combination from word 3 to drum 5. So make sure that all the red marks line up in a straight line. Let's put our words together. D R U M Oh, line it up, the red line, red mark and number five. Also notice, as I said before, there is a tongue and groove. If you can see it on the video, at this angle, there is a tongue and groove that helps the combination fit snugly together. There you go, drum five. And we put the end cap together, line up the holes to this hole right here. Also line up the drum five with a name master right to the side right here. Master must line up with a combination of drum five. So now all we gotta do is put our shackle back, click it, and now move our combination around. 
and it's now locked in place. Okay, let's open up the combination again. Drum five. Line up where it says master. D. R. U. M and five. Drum five, and it also lines up with master right here. Let's open it up, and here we go. We're all set. Do you remember earlier I mentioned if this lock is hackable? Well, another video showed that you can hack this so-called lock with this, with this tool here, a very thin flathead screwdriver. And they said that you can get in between like so and look for the red markings. But the company has done is created that tongue and groove in between these locks, in between these combinations, and therefore you can no longer see inside. I think this lock is very safe. So I give this lock a four and a half out of five star. So if you find this video helpful, Give me a thumbs up or subscribe. Thank you.